بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم لیٹس ٹاک مور اباؤٹ مائکروبل پیسٹیسائڈس اگین دیز آر دا پیسٹیسائڈس وچ ار کمپوزڈ اف مائکروبل سیلز اور دی پروڈکٹس ناؤ وی ٹاکڈ اباؤٹ بی ٹی ٹاکسن بائی بیسیلس فرنجینسس بٹ دیر آر سو مینی ادر مائکروبس ایز ویل وچ کین سرو دس پرپس فار ایگزامپل دیر سو مینی ڈیفرنٹ نیماٹوڈس ایز ویل وچ کین کل ڈیفرنٹ ٹائپس اف انسیکٹس اینڈ پیسٹس اینڈ دوز کین آلسو بی یوزڈ ایز سپرے اینڈ دی پروڈکٹس کین آلسو بی یوزڈ فار دس پرپس دیر آر آلسو ادر Uh, bacteria and other microbes which can serve this purpose as well and all these microbial pesticides can be combined together can complement each other because one type of microbial pesticide is active against only certain range of insects and pests and if we can complement this uh, with some other pest microbial pesticide we can achieve much more efficient results Another bacteria which is called as Bacillus spherecus is also known to produce a toxic uh, compound which is much more potent as compared to Bt toxic uh, Bt toxin and it is specific against against mosquito larvae Another bacteria which is called as Bacillus populi kills is host by its microbial load so different types of uh, bacteria different types of microbes can kill different types of insect by different types of mechanisms and this one is active against japanese beetle uh we can also use viruses as microbial pesticides as well as different viruses are known to be uh, effective against different types of pests you can see here there is a long list uh, mostly bacillus viruses are used for this purpose and a peculiar uh, uh, type of bacillus viruses which are also known as nuclear polyhydrosis viruses those are much more uh, interesting and can be used in this regard as well to kill different types of insects uh, these viruses have very interesting life cycle uh, these viruses are basically bound together in a protein crystal uh, and these are present on the leaves of the plants uh, when the insects uh, ingest these leaves the viruses enter the insect body and they reach the gut of the insect where the insect the enzymes of the insect they then degrade the protein coat of these viruses and the viruses are released and then these these viruses find their way inside the gut cells of the insects uh once they are in the uh, cells of the insect they find their way to the nucleus and they start replicating dna in 12 hours virus particles are then released from one cell and they affect the neighboring cells and in 24 hours the protective uh, coating of protein which was present initially on the viruses uh, that has been synthesized and again the viruses start making crystals and by this time almost by 24 hours or so uh, the body of the insect has all, almost been completely damaged and it basically is uh, just a structure that contains uh, the viral load only so you can see here it is a very interesting uh, life cycle of insects and the much research is going on uh, to use these viruses and such other viruses as pesticides to kill different types of uh, insects and pests again viruses are, are host specific uh, so again uh, these can complement other microbial pesticides to achieve much efficient results and again these are much more eco friendly as well this was about microbial pesticides i'll see you in next lessons